short and sweet. If you want to practice lighting in 3D, you need geometry for the lights to shine on. In other words, the more complex your scene is, the better you can experiment with light settings. There are loads of 3D models out there on the internet, many of them free of charge, but for a really complex, big geometry in the kilometer rather than in the centimeter range, cityscapes are great. I once did a tutorial about such a complex city kit and I complained about the poor rendering support for Maya Arnold users. At that time Arnold was no option. All we got were Blinn shaders and at that time I did not know how to convert, batch convert basically the Maya Blinns to Arnold AI shaders. I know there are other rendering engines around and they are very excellent, I think, but since Arnold is built into Maya, let me concentrate on this rendering engine. Anyway, in the meantime, we're in autumn 2022. This is not a problem anymore. I think all new kits by the US company Kitbash 3D offer the Maya Arnold option. That's what I'm showing you now. I have only a sky dome light and two Arnold area lights in the scene, nothing sophisticated. I did not arrange the buildings, props, bridges in a convincing way, I just left them in their original positions. Pretty boring actually, but you get the point. Kitbash 3D needs to make money, obviously. That's why they started a competition with this free kit. Download the free Minerva kit, as it's called, rearrange the geometry add a background and of course lights and participate in the contest. I'm personally not interested in any kind of competition, actually I never was. In any case it was nice to download this sweet 17 gigabyte scene and try it out. In order to get the Arnold textures mapped properly to all pieces of geometry you should create a new project in Maya which hosts the scene file and the folder with the textures. The scene file is in Maya ASCII format. If you save your experiment with this kit, you need to save it as Maya ASCII. Maya binary does not work here. And you need to be patient with such a massive scene. It takes long to load, it takes long to preview it with textures, and even longer to start the Arnold rendering preview. Six gigabyte is the scene file, 11 gigabytes are the textures only, almost 700 texture files. I rendered these brief animations with the graphics card first. It made Maya crash several times, so I switched to CPU rendering, which took many hours. Well, we're living in exciting times. Have a good day. Bye bye.